guys welcome back to my channel so obviously I've been gone for a little while but if you follow me on my social medias you would know that in the midst of rearranging my filming area and adding stuff to the room ie this bookshelf that I misplaced the um, charger for my camera battery and my battery was dead so I had to reorder a new charger and extra batteries to have on standby so that hopefully it'll never happen again um so yeah um also I redid my hair it is now like a dark brown to a silver it's really pretty uh, it's hard to explain and um, this video is not doing it justice so um, without further ado, we're gonna get into this video. This is gonna be a completely different video for my channel. I have been doing tutorials consecutively um, on my channel since I started, but today we're going to unbox the new mystery boxes from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. I have two of these. I bought both sizes, or my boyfriend bought me both sizes for Valentine's Day. Thank you. Um, so we're gonna open these. I've been holding out and I just got back from the post office with this one, um, the smaller one came in a few days ago. So, we're gonna go ahead and open those and see if they're really worth it or not. So, uh, keep all right, going. so let's get into this. By the way, let me, got, let me guys, let me know if you guys would like a tutorial on this look. Also, if you check out my Instagram, I posted a new photo of a look I did the other day that I need to know if you guys also want a tutorial on. This year is the year I play with color, so I'm super excited about this journey and adventure. So, yeah. Hopefully this new filming um, setup is a lot better than what it was. I know it used to focus a lot on the iguana cage in the background, so hopefully it doesn't focus too much on my bookshelf behind me with all my makeup on it. But we'll see. So if you guys, I'm just opening these boxes before I get into them, um, but if you guys know me, I love Jeffree Star Cosmetics. I have pretty much every single one of his products. So a lot of these things in these boxes are going to be repeats, but I figured I could share them or have backups, and I really just wanted the exclusive items in them. So I convinced my boyfriend to buy them for me. Alright, so let's start with the small box first. Um, these were limited edition and they came out, what was, what day was it? I don't even know what day it was anymore. Um, but the small box, I believe, I'm pulling it up right now on my phone. Let me see. Okay, here's the campaign photo. The small box was 40 and the deluxe was 75. So apparently the premium box is supposed to have $75 worth of savings in it and the big one is supposed to have $115 worth of savings in it. So it looks like the um, accessory is a pop socket, which I'm super excited about because I've been wanting a pop socket. It's a red pop socket with the Jeffree Star logo on it. So happy about this. Oh my God, you have no idea how excited I am. Okay, it looks like we got some lipsticks from the new Alien collection. I have the Alien collection, and I'm actually really excited I got these two because I know my friend really likes Triggered, so I got Triggered and Can't Relate, so I'm going to give these to her. I, I'm i actually really excited to re-gift some of these because um, I know my friends want these. So. This is triggered and can't relate. I have them already, like I said, so I'm gonna pull them out to show you guys so I don't have to open that one. Um, let's see. Okay, so can't relate is actually in my car because I used it the other day, but it is a really light nude. Um, triggered is this really pretty shade right here. I'm gonna try to find a picture of it online because the packaging is kind of hard to tell what color it is. It is a dark, purple. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's a really dark brownie purple. It's gorgeous. I am obsessed with it. It has flecks of glitter in it, but the packaging is really glittery, so 
None of the shades are really what they look like on the outside for this collection because of the packaging. So, but it's a really pretty shade. So I got those two shades and, oh, I got a lip ammo. I got Starfish, which I do not have. This is his original lip ammos. I have a couple of them. I have two from the Alien collection and one from the Valentine's Day collection last year. So this is what the packaging looks like for those. So this is what this packaging looks like. I really do like his lip ammos. They're very moisturizing. Um, so yeah. So it looks like Starfish has, yeah, it's like a pink, a really light peachy pink shade. I don't know if it's gonna pick up on camera the actual color that it is. I'm trying to get this to focus. Focus, focus, focus today. Okay, it's not focusing. But it's like a really pinky peach shade. So that's nice, it'll be fun to play with that. And I also got, oh, watermelon soda. I don't have this in my collection and I've been wanting to get it and putting it off. So I'm so excited that I got this. Oh my God, yes. This is like almost a bubblegum pink. Um, definitely reminds me of summer. All right, so the last thing in our little premium box is a highlighter. Oh my God, yes. I don't have this shade. This is his original highlighter formula, the Skin Frost. I do have a good amount of them. I have five of them, I think. Um, but this is the shade Deep Freeze, which I don't have. Um, no, it looks like it came shattered, which is very sad. I did see some people say that their stuff, their highlighters have been shipping um, shattered and I know it's not Jeffrey's fault like packaging problems happen it's fine whatever um, it is kind of sad though that I don't I won't have this shade I could repress it it's not horrendous it's like half the pan is broken um, I'm not mad about it it's not a shade I would wear every day I just wanted to have it in my collection to say that I had it to be honest um, so I'm not like really pissed about it, but it is kind of disheartening that I paid for it and it's broken, but that's okay. We're moving on. I still love Jeffrey. <laughs> okay, so onto the deluxe box. This is slightly bigger. This one comes with an exclusive t-shirt and a supposedly, so his Snapchat made it seem like the shirt came in just this box and the accessory came in just the premium. But um, I, like I said, I think I follow a fan page on Facebook and some people were, someone asked him because the promo poster says you do get the exclusive accessory and the t-shirt in the deluxe box. Apparently he replied to said person and said, <coughs> excuse me, you do get both in the big box. So I don't know if it's going to be the same accessory or not, but, oh, yes it is. So you do get both. So you get another pop socket, which I'm excited about because I put one on this phone and when I get a new case, I'll put it on that phone. So I'm excited, I'm gonna use that today. <clears throat> oh my God, I got a Supreme Frost. I love the Supreme Frost. I have two of them already. I'm so excited, I hope it's not one I have. It's not one I have. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm, like, I'm really excited about this. So let me go ahead and open this. This is Frozen Peach, which I'm super happy about. Look how pretty. It's not as metallic as the other two that I have, but it's a peachy gold. Oh my God, I'm gonna swatch this. Ooh, I don't have this one. Okay, so this, I also have a Skin Frost in this box. This is the shade Regina George. Let's hope that I've not broken. Um, so this is the shade Regina George, and it is a pink. It is a pink highlighter. These pans are ridiculously big, like, you'll never Oh, I have a lip liner. This box does come with a lip liner and I'm so excited because I got the shade Dominatrix, which if you're familiar with his collections, Dominatrix is his brown shade that he has in his collection. And I love brown lipsticks. Oh my God, I'm so happy to have this. So I've never seen his packaging in person. This is the first time that I have um, a lip liner from him. So this is cool. So this is the cap. Very, um, 
in your face. I love how obnoxious it is. The whole thing comes off. And then this is the pencil. So let me swatch this on my hand. Oh, wow. Okay, super creamy, like insanely creamy. And look how pigmented that is. Like what? I'm so excited to play with this and have this in my collection. I want them all down. I got the shade Self Control, which I believe I have. Yep, I do. Okay, so this is from his Valentine's Day collection last year. And this is the shade Self Control. It's a really light lilac color. It's very pretty. Um, but yeah, that's the shade. Oh my god. I'm looking at the rest of the box and I'm so excited because I have one shade that I had in my cart and almost bought. And I also have a backup of one of my favorite shades. So that's cool. Oh, oh my god, I wanted this one too. Okay, so this is a lip ammo in the shade Gargoyle. Oh my god. I'm so happy to have this. This is a brownish gray shade. Oh my god. I'm so excited. I had been putting off buying the lip ammos because I don't really like regular lipsticks. Um, so that's why I didn't buy this shade, but oh my god, swatching this, I'm so happy that I got this. Look at this shade. It is beautiful. Oh my god. I'm so happy to own this. So, okay, moving on. For the other two high, um, lipsticks that I have, I got the shade Crocodile Tears, which is just a dark green. This, so this is what it looks like with the Christmas limited edition packaging. This is the shade Crocodile Tears. It is a deep forest green is what I would describe it as. It is stunning. Oh my God. And I am so happy that I have another one of these because it's one of my favorites. So this is the new packaging um, for the, his standard collection, his permanent collection has the pink caps. So he made this one a permanent shade so you can now get backups of these, which is awesome because it's such a great shade. Um, and then I have the shade Doll Parts, which I'm excited about because like I said, I don't have this shade and I was interested in purchas purchasing it because although I don't like pink shades that much, this one is a pink that I think I might like. This is a dusty rose color. This is in the shade Doll Parts. I don't know if it's going to focus on this. I wish it would. Focus, focus. Okay, there we go. This is the shade Doll Parts. Um, so I'm really excited to try this. And last but not least, I did see a spoiler of this and I was kind of sad about it. Like seeing the spoiler, not sad about the product. Um, but I'm so happy that I have this. Oh my god. Okay, so I, the coolest part is I only saw the words. I didn't see the hand. This is legit. Okay. So this is a maroon, oh my god, I love this. This is a maroon shirt. It says, can't relate with the hand. Oh my god. So this is, I'm assuming this is supposed to be Jeffrey's hand. I love this so much. It has hearts on it and sparkles. I'm gonna wear this like all the time. This is fabulous. I love this. Um, but yeah, so that was, it's for the deluxe box and I'm pretty excited about all of this. The only thing I'm upset about is deep freeze, but like I said, stuff happens and deep freeze is not a shade that I would wear every single day. So I guess I'm not that upset that it's broken, but at the same time, it was the one of the more expensive items in the box and it was the only one in the box. So to see that it was broken was a little bit disheartening, but I did see a couple people say that their deep freeze was broken. So I kind of knew it might be, I was hoping it wouldn't be, but it is and it's whatever. It's like I said, it's not a shade that I would normally wear. So there's no hard feelings there. I'm still going to support Jeffrey. And I definitely think that if you're a collector of Jeffrey's or even if you wanted to try some of his products out, these were great boxes to get and the next time they roll around you should definitely think about getting one if you want to either build your collection or try out his stuff. Um, and I think it's worth it to get both because um, it ended up being $115 um, 
US to get both boxes and over a hundred dollars free shipping so to me it was worth it rather than to buy the deluxe box and have to pay about ten dollars for shipping because then that puts you at about with taxes about ninety something dollars so for like fifteen dollars more or twenty dollars more you can have you can have both so to me it was worth it <clears throat> to buy both and that was my reasoning to buy both you don't need both um definitely the boxes have their disadvantages and advantages um but I did like how there were no repeats, no repeats across the boxes. So that was really awesome. Um, and yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this type of video. I can do hauls like this more often if you're interested or, you know, just let me know. Um, I really enjoy watching hauls like this, unboxings, if you call it that. I love it. So I figured you guys would enjoy a little change up. Hopefully my schedule is back on track now and I don't lose another charger. So, um, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on this video, please and thank you. Um, also share it, please. Share it with everyone you know. Um, also, don't forget to follow me on all my social media that includes Twitter, Instagram, and Snapchat to keep up to date with what I'm doing and what's going on with my channel. I will channel. post links and descriptions for all of these products down below in the description box so you guys know what to check out um i'll try to post the prices for all of the things that i got also down below so you guys know how much money everything costs if something in this video uh if there's something in this video you would like to purchase i will say that the pop sockets and the t-shirts you can only get in this box so if you didn't buy the box you can no longer purchase these items which is kind of unfortunate, but hopefully he puts pop sockets on his site because I think it'd be really cool for everyone to have a pop socket. So, yeah. But thank you guys so, so much for watching. Please let me know what you guys are interested in seeing and if you would like more unboxing videos because I would be happy to do so. Um, so, yeah. Um, as always, I love you guys and thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Bye, guys.